You got time. You got time, man. Good. I thought I was. Happy Saturday to you. Good morning, fam. Do, 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 do. Good morning to you. Good afternoon to you. Say good evening to you. And good night to, to you. <laughs> That ain't nothing, man. How y'all doing? Like I said, good morning to you. Good afternoon to you. Good evening to you. Cook it. And good night to you. Wherever you at on this here earth here that belong to God by Satan it running it into the ground. Okay, cause y'all need to know it's what that is. Your creator love you and get back to God Almighty. In Jesus' name, amen. Cookie. So I'm here to read to y'all one more time. Because grandma not going to leave it alone, okay? So, yeah. We need to talk to God and grandma about that. I'm just doing my part. <laughs> oh, stop, me. I'm trying to tell you, when I started doing this, people was like, uh, I see it, but it ain't going to happen. It was like, it's happening, dude. You know? And you're not stopping it. So what are you talking about? It's like, <laughs> I see it, but it's not going to happen. And it's happening. You feel me? And I told them, all I'm doing is reading to you. And going in the living room and <laughs> Anybody can go in their living room and break down, man. Break down. Anybody can do that, yeah. There's no challenge to it. You can do it. Yeah. All I'm doing is reading. And <laughs> Yeah, I act like I'm taking people's toes or something. Yeah. I'm, I'm minding my business in my own little circle. It doing what it do. Yes. The rest is history, okay? That's the rest of it. God is not playing. The rest of what I'm doing is in God's hands, okay? It's always been in, in His hands. I can't even talk right now, bro. I'm excited. Let me try to calm down, okay? But I, I got much more I need to be doing to. I'm not going to try to hurry up and rush, but happy Saturday to you. Cook you. Yeah, in a natural way. You woke up, right? Right, yes. I hope you got on your knees, says your grace. It says your thankfulness. Appreciate you breathing again and continue, okay? Because it could be rest in Jesus' name, in Jesus' name. Amen, too. Man, I'm over here starting with laughing. We we fine. God is not playing. Alright, so we in the book of uh first P E T E R. First Peter Pan. I say Peter Pan. It remind me of Peter Pan. This whole book. Yeah. <laughs> The first Peter and second Peter, all the Peters. Remind me of Peter Pan, okay? I mean, let's y'all know that name. Yeah. So, the, uh, the world got their evil definition with Peter Pan. Like, they, said, they said the name, was, it came from the evil spirit. But then you got God's version. You got the holy version of Peter Pan, okay? You got the worldly, evil, wicked, way, and then you got the holy Peter Pan, you hear me? And he not losing. With the color green on, with the color green, man, he ain't losing. He not losing. Trust me. That's like, Peter Pan is like Slash Robin Hood. Okay? Like, I can give you another example since they like to be on on the boats. 
she like that uh which 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 Jack Sparrow but instead of saying Jack Sparrow, he Peter Pan, you feel? Me? Hey, that part. They just changed the name, man. Trust me on that. Trust me on that, yeah. That that movie, uh, uh, Pirates of the Caribbean, man, that comes from Peter Pan, bro. They ain't gonna tell you that, though. They not gonna tell you that. Cookies! All right, anyway, though, so back to the Holy Script. The title at the top of the page, uh, 1,526 for chapter 2 in First Peter. Uh, the title say, uh, okay, I forgot. I forgot the sign for submission, S-U-B, I mean, S-U-B-M-I-S-S-I-O-N. Submission to authority. Uh, authority, authority. Submission to authority, okay? Now, authority is of righteousness, okay? I'm, I'm going to tell y'all that now, man. So, those who call themselves causing terror, going around terrorizing people, that's a form of authority, but it has to be directly from God, okay? Because he controls bad and good. Okay, he can stop it when he went to. Okay, that's why I'm saying it. Okay, so when y'all be like, "Well, why did God? Uh, well, why did God allow all that?" Well, you need to ask him. Okay, don't ask me that. I I I, I submit to authority. Okay, so don't be asking me that question because I'm gonna submit. Okay, I'm not I'm not sure uh, cocky, arrogant, and rebellious. Getting your ass whipped. Yeah, you on your own with that shit. God will beat that ass, man. I'm not, I don't feel like it. I don't feel like getting my ass whipped by my heavenly father. Okay, I don't feel like it. You can enjoy your ass whipping. I'm not doing it. That's on your own with that shit. <laughs> you on your own with that shit. Y'all think God be playing out here, bro? That man is not playing. Then people walking around wondering why they getting tore up because they, they, they rebelling against the the very thing that's keeping them breathing. Like, when when you housing the Holy Spirit, you're not supposed to grieve the Holy Spirit. Man, you man, he's going to kick your ass so, for grieving the Holy Spirit. You do not want to grieve the Holy Spirit. Okay, So let's pray and read. Show you how serious that is. Just, man. Dear Heavenly Father, Lord, just Holy Spirit, thank you for this opportunity just to say thank you. Whew, thank you, Lord, for waking me up one more time. Whew, one more time, <laughs> One more time, Lord. On Grandma time. I pray all the spirits around me, the angels, Having that party up in heaven as it is on this earth. Glorifying everything you bless me to go through and continue going through. And defeating all darkness along the way. I pray the devil and his angels have no place. Memorial, say, do or touch near your innocent one, your innocent creation ever again. I pray that every weapon formed against us won't even make it, won't even make it to the thought, to their hands, to be put in place, let alone aim it at somebody that don't deserve it. I pray the whole time they thinking and doing all that, that you would turn their cunning and craftiness over on them so it won't hit nobody but them. And thank you for this opportunity to read your word to them that's watching me right now and pretending like they're not so they can get the warning one more time to put that evil and wickedness away and repent on their knees in their secret place. Yeah. Before your wife knocks them out and I can't I can't pray over them. 
and you told me to walk away, and I have no problem doing that. But I thank you for the permission to partake of your goodness to read to them one more time. One more time. Because I know it is you who are blessing them with mercy and grace. Lord, you say your grace is sufficient for thee. And with that opportunity, I do not take it for granted. I give it back to you. So that you may have your way in it. And your will will be broadcast it will be seen, it will be felt, it will be heard all over your earth as it is in your heart. Coming back to this earth, I thank you for this opportunity just to say thank you, Lord, for waking me up. And I pray that those who are listening and paying attention will give you all the praise and glory, uplift and exalt your holy name as you bless me to do. And if not, please have them not come nowhere near me so that I don't have to watch you beating them down in front of me because they refuse to give you your credit. They refuse to worship and praise you but have no problem taking your benefit. I cannot keep watching them do that. And so all I ask is you keep me away from those who don't have my best interest and who don't want to glorify you, Father. Because when you bless me to go, we're going to glorify you, Father. We're going to uplift, and we're going to worship and pray your holy name, Father. Because without you, we are nothing, Father. We are dead on the inside without the Holy Spirit, working on the aliveness, working on the keeping us going, working on long-suffering, but he's building us up through the long suffering because righteousness is powerful. It is the truth of an almighty God defeating all darkness, evil, and wickedness, coming at us, trying to take us out every day of our lives. Father, thank you for covering us with your love, sweeping us off our feet when we least expect it with your miracle after miracles, after miracles, blessings, raining down blessings, after blessings. And I pray that those who are ungrateful, you will keep them away from me too, because I am grateful, even for the little things you do, Father, which is really the big thing. And that's you holding my hand through it all. Please be glorified, uplifted and exalted, for the reading of your word and the healing of those who are paying attention in that dark place with your marvelous light beating down that evil and wickedness trying to take your children from you, Father. Thank you for reminding them again that they are stronger than the evil beating on them, that they can hit back with your truth, that they can fight back, stand up and fight back because you gave us the strength just to do that. And I pray they will take it into consideration that you are strong, almighty God, and not just weak, pompous, nerd, piece of crap that they think they can put in the box. Lord, you have our lives in your hand, in your hand, and in your hand, I thank you for watching over me, in your hand. And I thank you for guiding me in your hand, uh, and I thank you for holding my hand so we can get this glorification correct so man can't perverse your glory to the point where they lose interest in what's really going on. And that is finding out that our lives have been in your hand the whole time while man pretending like he has the power without you, Lord. Thank you for keeping me away from that. And thank you for providing this wisdom and knowledge on how to defeat people like that, who think it's okay to control people 
and and and, and oppress people, depress them to the point they want to give up on life. No. Thank you for positioning me to yell and scream at these people to get back to you before your wrath knocked them out. And I pray, Lord, that every second of this reading out loud, that your miracles will hit where it needs to hit, and it will do what it's meant to do. Save the lives from going to hell, because that's where they're headed to if they haven't made you Lord and Savior over their life. In Jesus' name, amen, thank God. Amen again. Man, I'm so excited. As you can see, I'm stuttering. So forgive me, y'all. I'm, I'm excited. I, I be minding my business, and people still keep trying me. So <laughs> okay. The last thing you want to do is compete with me, bro. That's the last thing you want to do, because I am not losing, dude. I wasn't sent here to lose, dude. Now everybody finding that out the hard way. Cookies. So let's read. Submission to authority in my Aunt Anna's Holy Bible. Cookies. Yeah, and then that's one, y'all. On page 1526. 1526. Chapter 2. Cookies. First Peter. Y'all ready? P-E-T-E-R. First Peter. And the mosquitoes again. All right, we're going to try to do this without getting bit. Y'all ready? Gave you a second to get there. <clears throat> In Jesus' name. Good. Verse 1. Wherefore, land inside all malice, comma, and all gout, comma, and hypocrisy, comma, and envy, comma, and all evil speaking, comma. Verse two, as newborn babes, comma, desire the sincere milk of the word, comma, that ye may grow thereby, Curry. Verse three, if so be ye have tasted that the Lord is gracious, period. Amen, rhyming already. Verse four, to whom coming, comma, as unto a living stone, comma, disallowed indeed of men, comma, but chosen of God, comma, and pressure, comma. Verse 5, yea also, comma, as lively stone, comma, are built up a spiritual house, comma, and holy priesthood, comma, to offer up spiritual sacrifices, comma, acceptable to God by Jesus Christ, period. Verse 6, Wherefore also it is contained in the scripture, comma, Behold, comma, I lay in Zion a sheep cornerstone, comma, Eli, comma, precious, comma, and he that believeth on him shall not be confounded, period. Verse 7, Unto you, therefore, which believe he is precious, comma, but unto them which is disobedient, comma, the stone which the builders disallowed, comma, the thing is made the head of the corner, comma. Verse 8. And the stone of stumbling, comma, and a walk of offense, comma, even to them which stumble at the word. Comma, being disobedient, where whereunto also they were appointed. Period. Verse 9. But ye are a chosen, chosen generation, comma, a royal priesthood, comma, and holy nation, comma, a peculiar people, semicolon, that ye should shew forth the praises of him who hath caused you out of darkness into his marvelous light. Curling. Verse 10. Which in time past were not a people, comma, but are now the people of God. Curling. Which had not obtained mercy, comma, but now have obtained mercy. Period. Verse 11. Dearly beloved, comma, I beseech you, 
as strangers and pilgrims, comma, abstain from fleshly lusts, comma, which war against the soul. Semicolon. Verse 12. Having your conversation honest among the Gentiles, calling that, comma, whereas they speak against you as evildoers, comma, they may by your good work, comma, which they shall be heard, comma, glorify God in the day of visitation, period. Verse 13, submit yourself to every ordinance of man for the Lord's sake, calling, whether it be to the king, comma, as supreme, semicolon, Verse 14, or unto governor, comma, as unto them that are sent by him for the punishment of evildoers, comma, and for the praise of them that do well. Period. Verse 15, for so is the will of God, comma, that with well-doing ye may put to silence the ignorance of foolish men. Curly. Verse 16, as free, Comma, and not using your liberty for a cloak of maliciousness, comma, but as the servants of God, period. Verse 17. Honor all men, period. Love the brotherhood, period. Fear God, period. Honor the king, period. Verse 18. Servant, comma, be subject to your masters with all fear. Not only to the good and gentle, comma, but also to the fury, the harsh, the, the bad, yeah, period. Verse 19, for this is thankworthy, comma, if a man for conscience toward God endure grief, comma, suffering wrongfully, period. Verse 20, for what glory is it, comma, if, comma, when ye be buffeted for your fault? Comma, ye shall take it patiently. Question mark. But if, comma, when ye do well, comma, and suffer for it, comma, ye take it patiently, comma, this is acceptable with, with God. Period. Verse 21. For even hereunto were ye called, comma, because Christ also suffered for us, comma, leaving us an example, comma, that ye should follow his step, colon. Verse 22, who did no sin, comma, neither with God found in his mouth, colon. Verse 23, who, comma, when he was reviled, comma, reviled not again, semicolon. When he suffered, comma, he threatened not, semicolon, but committed himself to him that judges righteously, colon. Verse 24, who his own self bear our sins in his own body on the tree, comma, that we, comma, being dead to sin, comma, should live unto righteousness, comma, by whose stripes ye were healed, period. Verse 25, for ye were his sheep going astray, semicolon, but are now returned unto the shepherd and bishop of your soul. Period. Chapter 3. Wow. Yeah, submit to God and you good. You want to be healed, right? You want to be made whole, right? Submit yourself to his Ten Commandments and he will teach you much more in between these Ten Commandments. So much more, okay? You can see that. You can see that. Yeah. Like, put down evil wickedness. Put it away and put down trying to hurt the next person. For me, I thought that was easy. It is. Until you got a bunch of people coming at you trying to try you. That's, that's when you need the Holy Spirit. You feel me? Like, Lord, make sure my reflect don't, you know, uh, yeah, I need your Holy Spirit, Lord, to do this correctly. Don't, don't be scared to call on the Holy Spirit. If, if you know yourself, when you feel you about to defend yourself, just make sure you, you do it correctly. You feel me? Ain't nothing wrong with defending yourself. But you have to learn how to uh, be in position for long suffering for the Lord 
Jesus Christ. Because he suffered long when he was being persecuted while he was here. So all he going to tell you is suffer long like he did. He going he gonna to build you up, yeah. Y'all think he's just going to leave you going through the pain and all that. That's what it feels like sometimes, and that's what it look like, but trust me. In the end, you're going to be like, yeah, I'm glad I did suffer and learn for Jesus Christ, not for man, confusion and perversion. No, that's not what I'm talking about. I'm talking about long suffering for Jesus Christ. All right? So if you're not healed, fulfilled, and satisfied to the mind, body, soul, and spirit, cook it. You already know what's up, right? You know what I'm about to say, right? Go in your secret place on your knees, ask for the Holy Spirit, yeah. So when you come back and reread it, you understand what you read, and you can see the secrets in between, in between the scriptures you are reading, okay? See, I'm telling you all do it in your secret place, because in your secret place, when God brings you out and leads you by the Holy Spirit, Publicly, he can reward you publicly for what you did privately with him. Okay? That's why I keep saying that. Go in your secret place and ask for the Holy Spirit. That way when you feel it, you can't deny that it, you know what's up, man, and you know what's about to come. Okay? <laughs> surprises after surprises. At, man, God is not playing, man. He's not playing, man. He be waiting on y'all to call on his son, and he can't do nothing until you call on his son. Jesus. There you go. Hey, cook it. So I ain't going to take too much of your happy Saturday. Be joyful. Don't forget to rejoice, worship, and pray. Stay man. Cook it. Hey. How you do that from your heart is how you do that from your heart. Don't be listening to other people trying to tell you how to worship who you believe in. That's a personal relationship. Okay? Now, when y'all can come together and do it, that's what's up. That's, that's even better, okay? The more, the merry. But don't be trying to tell each other how to worship your Heavenly Father. It's personal, okay? Until God brings y'all together to do it in harmony, okay? Yeah, y'all know it's that, okay? So, let me pop up off this uh, camera. I think I said enough, okay? I want to leave it on a good note, okay? As always, as always. Guard your heart with all diligence, okay? Guard it with all diligence, okay? Because that's the first thing the devil go after, your mind and heart. Okay? Yeah, so when you submit to authority, even though it's good or bad, pray. Pray. Okay, God will give you wisdom and knowledge. Even when you feel like you've been led by a bad person, he know what to do if you call him just like, Lord, trust me. You learn a lot when you just obey instructions. Even though you know that person giving instructions is evil, is a, you know they evil. But but God set them in front of you for a reason. You feel me? So obey God by obeying authority that He has set before you. Okay. So I'm I'm gonna give you an example. Let's say let's because I'm no I'm noticing um. The royal, uh, the worldly royal people, for example, y'all know uh, Princess Diana and her family. Okay, Princess Diana was, was sacrificed. Okay, she was murdered. Okay, for evil. Okay, we, we, we get that right out the way right now. I, I promise you, if she believed in Jesus Christ, she would have been saved through all that. But I think I think Princess Diana got killed off because Queen Queen Elizabeth, I think she was jealous of Princess Diana. Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. And I think uh uh her husband at the time, King whatever his name is, I think he was jealous of Michael Jackson. 
Yeah, <laughs> take that man, take that shit the wrong way, bro. I noticed that shit, man. I noticed that man. He was jealous, bro. So, of course, they got in their feelings and try to get rid of Diana. Y'all need to pay attention to why Mike made all these songs the way he made it, bro. He ain't just do it to do it. Nah, he had a purpose for every single last one of them songs, Jay. He was teaching us of what the was going on, yeah. He was telling us it was up to us to pay attention. Yeah. I think I was the only one that was catching on, yeah. I, I really believe that, yeah. I really believe that, yeah. But anyway, Princess Diana, she uh, she got killed. Uh, she was sacrificed by the satanic people, the satanic cults, and all that. So uh, God positioned me to call him out. They they know it's that well. They they they, they fishing and scrambling right now on how to get to me. Even if they get to me, I'm ready. I'm ready for what happened. Man. For what happened, because she been telling me this since Princess Diana died. Okay, since she died, I've been playing that song "Dirty Diana" for a long time, and I'm learning. I'm learning. These people out here in this earth that 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 think because they are uh, royalty, when they really not royalty is rich in spirit. Okay, because y'all perverting the shit out of materialism. Materialism is not royalty, man. It's not. And y'all keep using material to put a price on on the spiritual things. That that's backwards, okay? That's backwards, man. You take the material thing and ask God what to do with it, okay? So you don't piss them up, okay? If you glorify that material thing. That's idolatry. You feel me? You do not want to be idolizing anything before your heavenly father. He will take that thing and slap you with it. Okay? Uh, you don't want that. Yeah. I know I don't. <laughs> I know I don't. <laughs> so y'all know, uh, Mike, man, Mike was a real angel, man. He still is, man. His spirit is all over the place. Kicking evil's ass, okay? That's why I be telling y'all, you, you need to get back to Jesus, man. Who you think he is? Man. <laughs> That's why I said y'all too slow. Y'all keep playing with these demons, okay? See, God controls these demons, okay? He tell the demons what to do. Bam, and they go do it. So you need to be on the same side with Jesus Christ, yeah. And stop persecuting the followers of Jesus. Because they are protected by God, Almighty Jesus, okay? And they are gifted with the Holy Spirit to kick your behind at any time. At any time. At any time. He gave us the power to trample over any evil, wicked thing, y'all. Yeah. So I just needed to remind y'all to get back to that. Put the whole army of righteousness on and kick the devil behind. Stop losing, okay? You were created to win, not lose. In Jesus' name, amen. So I pray the Lord's good angels will continue watching over every child. And I pray that the teenagers out here will wrestle with understanding their flesh and the will of God to control their flesh so that they don't give their flesh over to the evil and kill themselves. I pray they don't do that. Please give them the urgency and conviction to go in their secret place on their knees and let it all out too. So that man can't pervert them ever again. It's just that, really. So, yeah. Love y'all. Peace. Put the weapons down. Pick the Holy Bible back up. Clap your ring. Cook. Oh.
keep flying up. Don't look down. Okay? Because you do not want to go to hell. And if you think you do, we're going to fight if you end up in there. We're going to, man, we're going to fight. Because I'm not doing all this for you not, okay, for you not to make it. You know? I need you to make it. You know? Otherwise, why are you watching me? In just that, amen. Good. Peace. Love you. Salute. Right. Good. And another one.